13 News starts right now. But can you believe this? What? It used to be something that only women did. I don't even want to guess. <laughs> but we never keep anything of our own for very long. Gigi Graciette hit the streets of L.A. And you're going to love this, by the way, Mark. Oh, great. Perfect. Where she found a whole subculture of men who knit. Can't wait. Ted does it because his wife loves it when he does. Kind of kicks it up a notch as far as like what you can offer. Justin does it too, but only when he's by himself. It's cheaper than going out and drinking all night. And Liam, the tattooed surfer from Australia, yes, he also does it, but he needed a DVD to teach him how. Kept on, you know, screwing it up. What these three men do is crochet. They are closet knitters. When people come over and they see this in the corner, it's like, what are you doing? You know, I, I didn't know you were into that. And I'm like, oh yeah, I crochet. They're like, what? Of course you do. He does, and he's not alone. Crocheting and knitting, definitely not your grandmother's pastime anymore. The original knitters were men. Uh, they used to make their fishing nets. Then women got into uh, making fishermen sweaters, etc. But I think it's coming a full circle. Marcy Levitas Hamilton created the Art of Knitting and Crochet DVD series. Her biggest clients, men. They may be a little shy about going to a woman uh, saying and revealing that they're learning knitting or crocheting. This way they can do it in the quiet of their home without anybody knowing. There are even dozens of websites for men who knit. We need also the support we can get. It's almost like AA for quilters. And while most men admit to getting some strange looks as they knit one pearl too, they all say in the end, women think it's pretty cool. It makes you seem like you're not a, you're a renaissance man. You're not afraid to open up to new things. Now, Ted crochets mostly for his wife and daughter, but Justin and Liam, well, they won't knit for a girlfriend. That's because in knitter circles, there's something called the curse, where if you knit for a girlfriend or boyfriend, you'll end up breaking up. For more information on the DVDs, check out www.theartofknitting.com. And by the way, I love that. I bet you and do. And they're all so handsome. You and Gigi love it. Wow.